Stay with the nerds like Uncle Jaleel. You know who it is, man. Shout out to everybody that's on the channel. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, man. We almost had 100 uh, subscribers. Yeah. So I appreciate everybody, man. We got KC3000. We got the Cosinet documentary, 30 Days. That's what it's called. Uh, I think it's going to be over his uh, 30 Day Subathon, Mafiathon that he had um, and showing how that took place or whatever. So we're going to go get right into it. I know the video is it's a long video. So we're going to go ahead and just watch it all the way through, react. Or whatever and let me know what y'all think about it in the comments man shout out to everybody that's here hopefully y'all stay and watch the entire video i appreciate it let's do it move to the bronx and when i was in the bronx is when things started to like you know feel normal you know i started to feel like a normal like things started to feel normal and go a little a little easier than than usual you know uh so what made you start filming skits for facebook oh my gosh the skits for the facebook man I remember like it was yesterday, my mom had got me a phone. When I got the phone, I was like, bro, I just wanna do, I just wanna, I was almost like the class clown in school. And after when I got a phone, Same. I wanted to do some videos with it. But I had made my Facebook actually because of Aunt Kathy. She was on Facebook a little bit. And I asked my mom if she would allow me to have Facebook. And she let me allow, she allowed me to have Facebook at a very young age. I probably think, I, I think, me personally, I think I made my Facebook when I was like eight or nine years old. When I got my phone, Same. I got in front of the camera and wanted to make different funny skits. And at the, at the time, I didn't care about who seen it and stuff like that. I didn't really care about, you know, who was like really like looking at the videos, if I could say. Um, I was just posting it for my free time, just seeing, um, you know, how it would look online. <laughs> How do niggas know me in the international airport? Like my nigga. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh shit. I'm sorry. <laughs> I ain't trying to be on no little groupie type shit. You care, right, for, you care for nigga get the picture, bro? Yeah, of course. Hell yeah, I bro. No I'm not gonna hold you. I want your shit. Where you headed to? Uh, I'm finna go to Germany. I'm stationed Damn. out there with the military. Damn. Germany. You want to shoot niggas over there? Hell no. They ain't got no guns over there, bro. They poke niggas <laughs> over there, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Come on, they safe flight, bro. Safe flight, my hey. boy. Keep making that content. Appreciate you, my boy. Bro. Thank you so much. I ain't getting sturdy. You ain't getting sturdy. <laughs> you wasn't getting ice spice dirty. Stop, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> What's good, bro? What's going on, man? Where you coming from? Where you about to go? Four minutes. Oh, man. Right, I'm cool. about to go to the UK. Oh you, turn, oh, you turn up in the UK? Yeah, it's the first time out the country, you bro. making a movie in UK, nigga. Yeah. Got to. Yeah, yeah. You be safe, too. Appreciate it, my boy. Definitely, and and um that way, I think he's he's a he's a big role model. He shows people like you could really do whatever you want to do, and you know that's really motivational. He, I think he motivated me to think that I, to believe that I could do what I want to do. Um, actually, in the business world, because I used to always think you know um, I'm supposed to go to school, make my mom happy. I was an honor roll student. Um, and go be a nurse because my mom is a nurse and my grandmother is a nurse. So I was saying I'm gonna go to college to be in the medical field. But now I have different dreams for myself because of college. Right. You better find out that your shit is in Tokyo. Unfortunately, <laughs> bro. Nah, I ain't gonna lie, that. This thing is way faster than one in fucking America. You think so? Nah, you in the UK dick, bro. I need a hard reset, though. Like, I need to push my TV to shower. I need 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 to shower. I left the country for the first time by going to the UK. And uh, as soon as I got my passport, it was like two days after I was able to leave to the UK. I got to the UK. Well, first of all, KSI had hit me up saying like, yo, we want you to fly in this day. And it was like three days like after he told me that. The date that he wanted was like three days after he told me that. And so I'm like, yo, I didn't even got my passport yet. This is, this is not going to be it. Got my passport the next day. Mm. They booked my flights over there. When I went over there, I'm going overseas for the very, very first time. Longest flight I've ever had. 
you feel what I'm saying, landed. My favorite thing about the UK, I'll probably say was like the, um, how kind everybody is, like at least from what my experience like. Cheers, appreciate yes. you. Yep. Wait, can you get your passport <laughs> expedited? Shit. <laughs> the act, the accent change and like seeing the vehicles a whole lot of different and the stores and like the scenery. You could tell you're Old not in the shop. United States. You feel me? And um, just seeing how people work over there compared to the U.S. was probably the fun part. And you know, just get to, getting to learn like, you know, like the jokes over there or the food over there and stuff like that. That's probably like my favorite thing about it. Just the exploring part. It is an exploring experience. Uh, I don't see none. None. No. Outrage. No. Can I put your hand up? Please. I mean, if it was a yes, absolutely. But ah, uh, yes, yes. It was a no. Yes, yes, oh, yes. 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 Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. yes. Oh, yes. Why are you doing it? Uh, 20 so, runs that I did with it? Simon was no way out of my. He's be having fun. I was literally ready for that. I was literally waiting on the day they had made that call. You feel what I'm saying? They finally made that call, but. The 20v1 was very like, you know, that was really me. That was in my circle. That was exactly right up my alley. And, um, you know, I just went there and I put on the show. And then, you know, the rest is the rest. Is the rest you feel me? As soon as it went out, it started going crazy. And I was glad I was there. Bro, what? That shit was ass. No. <laughs> yeah. I would say what makes Kyle Kai is like his jokes. Like being able to be the, the funniest, not, not the funniest in the room, but being able to stand out in the room. Like whenever there's a room that Kai's in, it's like you know it's gonna be valid because like he's there and shit. And the, the jokes that go on and shit is like, it's, it's, I ain't gonna lie, it's, 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 a, it's, it's important. Cause like everybody in this family, they, they play a role. So it's like Devontae plays his role, I play my role perfectly fine, Kai plays his role perfectly fine, the same. So it's like without the jokes and shit like that from Kai, it wouldn't be the same. Oh yeah. Michael Jordan! Michael Jordan! Um, the most memorable Michael moment, Jordan. I would say, um, is seeing the Simon in person. Like, seeing him in person because I grew up on YouTube and I've seen everybody do YouTube and I've always said that it's gonna be weird for me to like meet people finally, like for the first time ever. And seeing the Simon in person for like, for like something I would wanna do is like, it's crazy. It's something that I wanna, I grew up seeing them. It's crazy. Like, the fact that I was in person and actually working with them and they wanted me to be a part of something, that they have planned is crazy. And also getting to see them work in a work mode, knowing that I'm a part of a group, you know, I'm a part of AMP, seeing them go so far and take things so far, I could just learn from them. I kept telling them that like, these are people that I can learn from and apply it to what I got going on, so. How you feel? Good, man. I feel amazing. Like I'm tired, but I feel like I did shit. I did shit. I barely did shit, like you did the shit. No, but I did the shit. But then I did the shit. But we did the shit. Yeah, we did the shit. Yeah, we gotta do shit. Like, no, but I need to sit. 15 days. <laughs> Facts. Real shit. Boy, wake up. Tired? Imagine Q left in here and Nick come in here. <laughs> and drive off, bro. Yeah. I'm gonna be fucking tight. <laughs> tired? Hell yeah, nigga. I don't even know how I'm tired. I'm just tired. It's that jet lag, bro. That's because you was up early. I'm gonna eat and I'm taking a nap. <laughs> Is them Apple headphones valid? Are those valid, chat? 17 days until. Southern officially starts. 17 days of Southern Fun Club. Look at the offline chat right now, man. Look at all these losers. In the I'm joking. Look at those, those, the gang. That's the gang. 17 days away. And I think I'm underestimating on how long a month is. But fuck it. You know what I'm saying? Little y'all know that we want to go to LA. Like, it's going to be a whole different vibe. So I'm going to get a whole bunch of energy. You know what I'm saying? 17 days alone is long. Yep. 17 so. days. But it starts now, man. Let the countdown begin. <laughs> We in Houston, Texas right now, just walked in this shit, just landed here. Um, it's now 41. 
We gotta stack up on videos with A and P before I go into hibernation for the Mafia a thon. You feel what I'm saying? We got Chris, Chris down the hall. Let me see, let me see if your CB. Is the, you got your car? Yeah. Nigga, everybody just woke up and shit like that, but we about to hit the road to go to go to Jadeon and then go to Austin. Shake from there. Where's CB? Yo, CB! Fuck! <laughs> CB! CB! Main channel editor. It's Chris. It's Chris, man. Mm -hmm. Say what's up to the documentary, bro. What's up, gang? <laughs> uh, I haven't been a little night. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, bro, bro. Yo, bro, watch out, bro. Yeah, you made it the phone today? Yeah, I had, uh, I had me, uh, a little shy last night. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a little shy last night. Yeah. Hey. Yo! Hey, Chris, what is that? Look! Ew! Ew! I'm this nigga, this nigga. Ew! Yeah, this nigga went crazy! I didn't, I didn't even have Burke, stop. <laughs> nah, bed sheets off. <laughs> Ew, this nigga had, this nigga got cold. This nigga was going crazy. This nigga was like this. <laughs> <laughs> That boy's going crazy! What the fuck? You got a whole crazy tech. It's like a fucking high school musical. What the? Joe Bolton. Got my twist cock chocolate right now. We gotta do this video for RBC. We were supposed to do two videos this trip. We only got to do one, unfortunately. But we're in some high school musical ass theater right now. Come on, nigga, Duke Dennis, man. Duke. About to hoop on these niggas, about to kill them again. Yesterday we beat them in basketball. Duke. Today we're gonna beat them in basketball once again. Let me see, let me see, let me see your, your, your spin move. To the lay, to the rim. Spin move to the rim. Ooh. Boy cannot hoop. Oh, that's terrible. That's terrible. <laughs> look, Mark. <laughs> I'll be telling you one look, bro. How do you feel about that shoe? Uh, you know, you're trying to get your dad to look at something. Dad, look. Dad. <laughs> dad, look. <laughs> look, Mark. <laughs> How much you drop into the? So but I don't know, cause when I talk shit, it's like it doesn't back up. So. All right. No, you when I talk shit, you got you know what I'm saying. How you feeling? Like I, I feel like I jinx myself when I say that, so I'm I'm, I'm not gonna score at all today. You think you're nice at both? Him? Yeah. Yo, Phantom said you he thinks you're pretty say, good. I didn't say that. I didn't say nothing. I said you think oh, he said. Oh I'm nice at fucking. You gonna fuck more than me? What? You got more body than me? You, nah, you, you a hoe. You get hoes. I got respect for my body, bro. You do. You get hoes. Bro, what? No, no, Casey, don't kill me. There's a Yankee you. Kai's grown a lot, not in terms of size really, uh, just more in terms of, I think like mindset. It's ah, a mindset type of growth. Shot. Like just the way he attacks things. Like he's very clever and smart, like behind the scenes. Like he, he doesn't show it. And a lot of it is just intuition. Like he just knows what his audience is gonna enjoy. And his ability to execute on it is like really, really impressive. So I said he probably grown a lot just in terms of his ability to operate. And even like as a business person, this nigga's not buying chains and shit like that no more, bruh. Like, well, that's not true. He has two colossal chains, but like he, that's like a, he just makes so much money. That's nothing compared to the amount of money he makes. Like he spends a majority of the lot of money he has, like really being smart with it. Like he's not dumb. Well, that's so like, he's grown a lot like financially. AMP, well. I said AMP, agents of troll. AMP still gotta get work done. Oxtails, rice and peas, stool chicken. More than cheese. No hitting this camera. Steph Curry, that is the goat. 
It's your boy Kissy Pan the beat. Show up, come on and suck off your meat. Come if y'all to come take a seat. It's a tough right there, right on the seats. King's done to a lead. Look down, cross from my feet. I'm not Jamaican, but I like the blue boy. It's not playing with me, baby. I'm not a toy. Squeeze me like an orange. Make me like a The preparation for the summer thumb was crazy. Man. I had bought myself, I bought, we bought a big whiteboard. Right, I bought a big whiteboard, put it up on my wall, and for six months, I remember when I first got it, I told my chat, yo, I'm going to be doing a subathon in February. And it was like way before, it was like months before. And each day I'll be, I'll be brainstorming, writing down ideas, you know, trying to make sure the best ideas was good, trying to see what ideas was bad, um, trying to see what's going to really entertain people because the way I thought about it was off my 24 hour. I wanted to be something entertaining every single hour. But off doing something for 30 days, you got to make sure to do something. You got to make sure the ideas are not overused. You got to make sure the ideas are spaced out mm -hmm. and some space in between to do what you want to do, or else you're just going to bring yourself out. So I have put a whole bunch of, you know, ideas on the board for six months straight, you know, without nobody knowing, without anything getting leaked. Um, and I felt like going into the summer time, I felt like I was prepared. I felt like I was ready and everything was prepared. The only thing worried me was about like making sure that everything goes according to plan and making sure that everything is ready to go on so many ends and so many levels. Hello? What's up? I'm sorry. This is definitely not the best timing for this to be happening. <laughs> yeah. Sorry about that. I don't know why. I'm sorry. I'm like, I don't even know why they would even ban me for it's the edible thing. It's like it's like consuming alcohol. Like they like the the trust team. They're just very strict on like drugs. Yeah, but that's happened. But that's happened before though. Like I've seen. Like I, I wouldn't have done it if it was COS. Oh, okay. I think on this one, you guys are saying like let's let's get uh, let's eat these many edibles until we get reach this goal. I, I don't know. Like I'm not sure because I didn't watch anything. But that's. It sounds like you guys are tying drugs consumption to like incentivize people to participate anything that's like mildly like Dang. seen as you harming yourself is like a big no-no so like but like don't like don't feel bad about this stuff like it's okay i understand maybe you've done it before like it sounds like this time was just a little bit more uh like yeah i just got you know? like what's it called because we supposed to be starting everything we're supposed to be starting everything february 1st like, i don't got stuff lined up but that messes up that messes up a lot of shit though, like bro, my whole shit is February first. Like that's like well, we have a lot of things booked, like already for the second. But now the first and the second are booked. So now I have to and things on the third, like everything will have to shift. That's that's too much. I would never did that if I knew it was TOS. And I just don't like they they just ban after like it happens. Like they'll ban they'll ban you after everything is already done been done. Seven day suspension, dangerous consumption of alcohol or drugs. How? It's probably when you were passed out. <laughs> and then you three as well. Take steps back. Keep going, keep going, keep going. It'll be pretty far, so that way we don't see you. You don't see camera, we don't see you. And then Cut. Will yell trumpets, and then the two of them will go up. And then... Cut that. Yeah, let's do that one more time. The one in the middle is moving too much. So remember to come forward a little more because you're still blocking him. All righty, rolling. Rolling. Three, two, one, action. Yeah, feel the riddle. Yeah, feel the beat, y'all. <laughs> Seriously. I know that. I know that instrumental is coming. It's fuck. No, we're going to get some. Yeah. Cut, 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 that's perfect. How you feeling, man? Chilling. You good? Yep. Yeah, yeah, we just His ideas got done doing so the, like, you know, the violin uh, scene. So it's looking, looking good right now, y'all. We're about to right now, skin? we're going to get the, uh, the three little, uh, three ladies so right here. Uh, we're about to have them saying good morning, my nigga, to Kai. It's going to be the funniest thing ever, y'all. Are, so are they all black? They're all black. Just yeah. making sure. Nah, but yeah, so we're, just making, we're sure. making a movie, though. Yeah. For sure. <clears throat> Ladies, please just look <laughs> over here. You're looking over here. Just stay focused, smiling. <laughs> Ladies, keep going, keep going. Black excellence, black beauty, black royalty. Two, one, action. Good morning, my nigga. One more um, time. We. Good morning, my nigga. 
Like more like Good morning, my nigga. Yeah, like <laughs> this is your he's the king. Like now. he's the king like he's a like in the scene he, he's basically talking to the king. Right. So she did good though. Keep so going. one more time, okay? Good morning, my nigga. That's cool. Cut. Yep, yep. Yeah. Perfect. Uh, perfect. Yeah. Everyone stay there. Good job. Good job. Next. Three, two, one, action. Okay, everyone's looking serious. All right, three, two, one, action. What? Why is that so lit? Cut, that's perfect. Oh my God, that's perfect. <laughs> Twitch partner, Cosnet has been unbanned after three days, seven minutes, and 31 seconds, man. Just hit Twitter. Yep. Oh, shit, bro. Right in time for the um, subathon. I was just gonna hear watching KSI's little you know, documentary and shit like that, eating some good ass mashed potatoes, bananas. See, I'm on my healthy shit, bro. You feel what I'm saying? That's water, you know what I'm saying? But, now yeah, it's go time. Now we just gotta wait. I think I've got two days left, bro. When Kyle was going into the subathon, what were your thoughts about it? <laughs> Dude, I don't really give a fuck. <laughs> All right, that ain't none of my business. Like, he decided that he want to spend 30 days nonstop on film, on camera. Like, you know how weird they got to feel? Like, you in the shower, hundreds of thousands of people watching you, and you washing your dick under swim trunks. That's his choice, and that's his business. I'm weak. Oh, I'm about to be fucked. <laughs> hey, yo. Just about 24 hours till you start. Yeah, technically it's about. I was already blowing my phone up. <sighs> gotta drop this trailer though. The trailer about to get back to me, bro. Where Ew, bro, what are you trailer? eating? I was Ew. Just like, yo, bro, fuck. I need to get, I need to get on my water intake, bro. But count down, to, count down till I go home. You just motivated me to get Let on my days. water intake. Ah, shit. Then you go buy we should have a F1. I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna be a fucking movie. I thought the subathon was a crazy idea, me personally, but if there was one person that was gonna do it well, it was probably Kai Sinat, man. This nigga has infinite energy, has infinite ideas, it feels like, and Agent. just like each moment in the stream feels like its own moment. This is like probably the one, the first, and maybe the only time we'll see something like this on Twitch. It's special. Nigga, I'm ready to go into this shit. Right now, this I'm feeling very good because I've been in the inspirational. gym. Had a nice little massage today. Um, feeling good. But can't we just have fun? We gotta be happy thoughts. Think happy. Have fun out there, man. You know, it's less than 24 hours until you start. Yeah, man. Less than, it's dead ass less than 24 hours, bro. Damn. Damn, man. man. Oh. oh, I'm just waiting for day 30. It's a countdown. That's all it is. Countdown. It's go time tomorrow. Just have fun out there, play video games, bring the content, just make people laugh, make people be entertained. You do anything to prepare yourself? Just the gym, had a little massage today, had a little cheat day with some food, just to, you know, being happy thoughts, and that's about it. And after that, we get some nice, some good rest, some good rest. I have to wake up tomorrow morning. Man, Better to go I was to say the thing that made me do a subathon. First of all, I don't even know what convinced me to do a subathon, but seeing the work and the effort that people made to watch me on a daily basis made me do it. What really, really, really made me do it was when I was doing my 24 hours and um, we were getting closer and closer to 100,000 subs. And my supporters from that broke my broke crazy records of, of, me, of my personal records of getting 100,000. And I never thought I would see 100,000 subs um, of just being consistent, but they made it happen. And once that happened, um, it, it, it planted a seed in my head that maybe probably I could do a subathon and I'll probably be able to, you know, break the record. And when that, when the 100,000 thing happened, I could just feel the momentum within the chat. 
and within myself. And like, like this is this is this is just only the beginning. And I was like, it just fueled me enough to, you know, just want more. Any any thoughts of like being what I do? Nah, it's the anniversary, bro. I feel like right now, for some reason, right now is like the perfect time. I don't know why. Son is telling me right now is the perfect time. I've been talking to God. He's been talking back with some blessings. You feel me? So right now, I don't know why I got a little feeling in me that this is the perfect time to do everything right now. But I don't know if I'm going to like being in L.A. for this long. Like being in L.A. for this long, I'm going to just act like, because they go, I'm streaming, because being in L.A. this long is a long time. So, you know what? It is what it is. I'm excited to see who's gonna come through the house. I'm excited to see the moments that's gonna be made. I'm, stay with I'm the excited blisters. to see a lot of stuff that's gonna happen. Um, and I'm excited. I'm just excited to get closer with my chat because this, whoever can stick with it from 30 days, by that 30th day, I feel like everybody's gonna feel way more locked in than it was before, just because this is, this is like a whole, a huge thing. So yeah, I can't wait. I mean, going for that record too. Hopefully we can make some Black History doing Black History Month, man. I'd be fire. Facts. That was a great. Talk, I've had so many talks with bro, and just his thing. He always told me he was like, man, I don't even care about the money, bro. He says he cares about milestones. Say. And to even hear that from somebody is so dope because it's like, bro, you don't care about none of this, the imp revenue or anything. It's like you want to be the first to be something and do something and, and set boundaries. You know what I'm saying? And so the fact that he's even doing all this, it's like to be when he told me. Bro, I think he said shit like couple like December or before December. He was like, bro, I'm doing a, a subathon and I'm gonna be streaming 30 days straight. I'm like, bro, you like nigga, you done that shit before. Like you literally stream every fucking day. He's like, nah, I'm not cutting the camera off. I'm like, what you mean? Like, he's like, I'm like, you washing your ass? All that shit? He's like, yes, on camera. I'm like, that's beyond me. <laughs> that's kind of crazy. Go ahead and do that thing, bro. But the fact that you can even do that and agree. stick to it and not even break and just, if anything goes wrong, back to it, not giving up. It just shows the work ethic is crazy. I've never seen nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I'm sure Twitch hasn't even seen anything like that before, so. Go Tom, go Tom. Look at the chat, look at the chat. Look at it, yo, these niggas dick riders. Look at them. They waiting. They waiting so long, bro. What do you mean? Of course they waiting. Black in the timing, bro. It's be, it's be like a team up. Black nigga go, come on, time, bro. Come on, bro. You better have fun in this shit, bro. Time to pray. I gotta pray real quick. All right. Let's do it. Put a lock in. My favorite thing by far about streaming is the closer connection with my uh, with my community. Um, you know, the people that watch me every single day is what keeps me going. Literally. The people that come in and stop by, people that been stuck right for now, so bro. long keeping me from going day right one now. to see me to see everything grow. It's like seeing a kid grow up. That's like the most best thing. I always felt like on YouTube skits was good, but like I feel like the connection is just even stronger when I'm streaming. It's just like it's it's just. Natural. I could be me in front of everybody, and everybody could just be them and just tell me, tell them what, tell me what they think about me, and then we'll just build that connection from there, and just as a family, you know. And then that was the best thing. Okay. Wait. Okay. Wait. Hold on. What's up? Did you just fart? Sorry, my bad. My bad. Did you just fart? My bad. Bro. I mean, you literally just farted. My bad, bro. Like literally, you just farted just now. Like just, just like, do y'all hear that? It's the caffeine, bro. It's bad. <laughs> me and SQC went to Universal for the first time oh, when I was doing the subathon. That was my first time getting out the house for real, for real. Dang. So it was a big refreshing start, and um, SQC is amazing for even uh even you know coming out with me to Universal and just being ready to be down to do anything at any time. Thanks. And when we went, I had a blast. Like I, it was probably one of my favorite streams. For the subathon, I had a blast going to Universal. Seeing everybody that that was that we watching at Universal was great. Um, 
just the fresh air, just the vibes was too good. I'm not gonna lie. All right. Oh! Oh! Dang. I feel like his team, you, you, you know what I'm saying, his day ones, Brianna, Cuddy, everybody, to be able to come in, you know what I'm saying, and just be the day ones and just help him. Because at the end of the day, y'all gonna be the ones to tell him the real, real, where he's fucking up and where he can move wrong and become better. People don't understand, like, it's not all one person, it's a team, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like sometimes that gets overlooked a lot, where it's like, they think it's just the, always the face of something. Beyonce's not doing all by herself. She's, a, she's the face of it, she's doing great, but she got a magnificent team that makes her the best she can be. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like everybody that plays their part is it, all a big, it plays a big part. Everybody's role plays a big part in, in his success. You feel me? Yo, Coco Jazz, the file, get the PJ Coco Jazz. Show, show, show the camera, show the camera real quick. Chat, say what's up to the documentary. So we are about to hit 189. We woke up today with 180,000. I don't know what's going on right now, but Frederick Douglass Academy is that my high school? Bro, I don't know what's going on right now, but we are about to literally break 189, bro. Night of the games with the five gets appreciated, bro. Look at this. Look at the chat. Look at, look at this. Kimmy with the five gifted. Look at them. Waffles with the five gifted. Oh well, Mecca Mech with the five with the fifty gifted. Angel with the ten. Oh well, Mecca Mech with the fifty gifted. Angel with the ten. WWSD, bro. WWSD with the one hundred gifted. <sighs> Evan from five gifted. Thank you so much. She with the five gifted. Thank you so much, bro. Oh my gosh. Mello with the five gifted. Kimmy head with the five gifted. Porter. Put a place, thank you, bro. Royal Rising with the with the 10 gifted. Thank you. Snooze with the five, bro. We about to do it, bro. As with the 10 gifted. Wait, King we passed 189? Bro, yes, look. Morgan with the five. King Zombie. Bro, I'm about to go jump in the pool. Bro, we hit 190. I'm doing, I'm doing a bad shit, bro. 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 He was going crazy. With the 10 gifted. Dalian with the 10 gifted. Oh my god. Vize with the 10 gifted. Ow, Vize Visions with the 10 gifted. So when they give sit, subs, oh do that just go right to your bro. sub count? Come on, come on, fuck. Ow, I, you know, I camera. seen the, 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 the transformation you from, Ow, you know, Rats and that to Kass and that. And we all, like, the whole AMP, we knew, like, <laughs> bro, Kai got the potential, like, to be one of the biggest, you know what I'm saying, content creators in the, in the universe. Because, like, Aliens is this too, so. Even them niggas, he got them niggas beat as well. So, shit, like, once I seen, it was, I remember, boom, it was a video where we, we dressed up at, in Walmart clothes. And it was like one of his like first, first videos and everybody was telling everybody like, somebody go jump in the pool. And everybody was like, nah, but he did it. Like he did it, he went and jumped in the pool, like no hesitation, he was like, I do it, boom, did it. And I was like, nah, like, that was tough because it really showed me that he ain't had no fears, bro. So I knew he was going to be something okay. special for real. 189. Type shit. 189. Buddy, I'm 190, bro. Buddy, I'm 190. Our professor with the 10. Everybody in the mafia right now, bro. Oh my gosh, man. Bro, we hit 190,000, bro. Chat, spam here if you were here. Spam here if you were here. Let me see. Let me see here. Let me see W190, MGM, MGM. Bro, I'm out of, bro, I'm out of panic. I'm trying not to get crazy, bro. I'm trying to chill. I'm trying to chill, bro. This is not even real. I don't want to say nothing, but people don't think it's going to happen. But I'm going for the record. And if you look at this, if you look at that screen right there, it's everybody who's been in here for 20 days. People don't even get sleep. People don't people, people don't even get sleep that's in here. Yeah, that's me. There's, there's new people that's in here. <laughs> there's new people that's adapting. You feel me? Bro, this is crazy, bro. Everybody's gifting in here right now and it's, and it's still going. Look. Having my whole family visit me during the subathon was great because one, I never would think I'd be in a position to even fly my family from the east to the west. Um, I know my siblings were like, 
excited to see how LA was. I, I think that was a, that was all the first times being there. Um, my mom really traveled, so having her out there was great. And I did it at the right time of um, about closing in on 200,000, which is a huge milestone from 100. So I was glad that they was there, and I was just happy that they was there to hit it together. You know, we was all there to hit it together, and they really enjoyed an experience that comes once in a lifetime. So having them there was huge on my end. My twin sister, my brother, my two brothers, and my mom was like a big thing for me, especially it was like day 20 or day 21, I think. And, um, you know, you know, I was, you know, that's that's something I, would, I was wanted to happen and came in at the right time. That's lit, bro. He's such a humble guy. Hey, what's up, buddy on the, on the right, bro? Be, be happy or on his left. Happy. Why are you scratching your head? Oh, we got 201,000 already, bro. It's the final run that Razoo with another 50 gifted. Razoo, not Damn. playing. Razoo be my guy, Queasy. 200,000 <laughs> is crazy. Merch NLE Chopper, though. <laughs> Ghetto Gamers Entertainment said WW. Razoo with the 50 gifted, bro. Thank you. Everybody said W Razoo in the chat. Smirk here. Dirk here. Razoo with the 50 gifted. Appreciate it, man. Oh my gosh, bro. Let me see how that looks. How that look? Let me see. Ready? Do it another, another pose, another pose. Told, this is gonna be amazing, bro. Devontae, isn't it? You're not taking a thumbnail. What, like, what are you doing? You're back at the regular, bro. Bye. I think what makes Kai and how a lot of people enjoy Kai um, is his personality, his motivation. I just always look at him as my twin. I feel like I'm really close to Kai on a different level uh -huh. versus with other people. Um, I think me and Kai have a special connection and you know. Um, yeah. Yes, sir. Come on, look good. You know the Huss is watching. <laughs> <laughs> the Huss. The Huss. The hus. The hus. Let's just shout out the hus. They need love too. Uh -huh. My favorite part of the uh, Sympathon so far. Ooh. Um, damn, bro. Gotta be him here. Two hundred thousand. He had his mama. He had, you know, what I'm saying his family members. And there was like a, there was a moment. This that like, you dream of those moments right there. So, it was definitely that two hundred k. I'm Mr. 240. You're Mr. 240. We can go for 250. Yo, yo child, I should try to hit it. I had a hot shot. You're trying to get to hit it. First time I heard of Kai, we was watching, me and my chat, we was watching AMP videos. The Your AMP videos were always in rotation. Always in rotation. Every Monday when they uploaded on Mondays, it was always in rotation. And one of the basketball videos they was doing, Kai was in it, but he wasn't playing. He was on the sidelines making little jokes and stuff and doing little silly shit. This TV, this TV right here? I want TV, yo, 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 listen. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I ain't gonna lie, you getting your ass kicked out there. Yeah, at like, first, I was like, who the hell is this loud ass? Who, who, who is this jit? Who is this random ass nigga? Who is that? Right? Me and Chad's like, who the hell is that? So but after like random? one or two videos, I was like, yo, chat, I'm not gonna lie. I like dude. I, I I like his vibe. I like his energy. I like him. He cool. He funny. I kind of like dude. You feel me? I guess he seen my. He started seeing my reactions, and we both like followed each other on social media. And then DM start going back. We're like, yo, I see your reaction. I fuck with you. This that the third. Ah. We just kind of became cool in, in, in messages. And over time, you know, we're just internet homies. He kept telling me like, yo, like. I like what you're doing on that streaming tip. Like, I like it. Like, you have like a community. Like, they support you, they ride for you, your reactions are OD. Like, I, I want that. Like, this YouTube, this YouTube stuff is cool, but the streaming shit is a little different. And then that's yeah, when I him. kinda try to start getting him into streaming. When there's already Phantom and other people are already telling him to, but I think him seeing me react to him and other people and him really looking at chat, YRG, and how they move really got him like gave him the all right, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna start this shit. And ever since then, we just been homies, call, call each other up for anything, uh, texting all the time. That's just been my dog ever since. Hey, I swear! Oh, I mad long, bro! Bro, Kason! Hey. Oh my gosh, wait, hold on. Oh, oh, oh. 
Why it's so hot in it, man? How was it How was it so hot? <laughs> Mafia thought. Oh man, it was crazy. You know, unpredictable. I'd say like, think about what made the Mafia thought so fun and crazy. It's like we just never really knew what we were gonna do. So like, any given moment, like something crazy was about to happen, or we were just really being friends, like in a house, having a good time, man. So that was uh, it, like felt like a kid, cause I'm old. Chad got some tough news. Ma, I got some tough news. What's the tough news? Tough as in bad or tough as in good? Tough as in like, uh, we don't know what's gonna happen. Okay, what, 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 uh? Uh, so, I like what subs end March 1st, which is like tomorrow. I mean, sub, could go down, sub count could go down. We will literally have to try to hit 300K today. Break the record and hit 300K today. Definitely, okay, so let me write that. You need Mama Senna on the stream. Once uh, uh, every hour. <laughs> no, okay. no they're gonna be able to. They're gonna be. They're gonna be able to do it. Trust me. I know they're gonna do it. I'm calling you for the world record, though. Okay, you better call me for the world record. Once you put your mind to it, you can do it. Once you really put your mind to whatever you got going on, and you really wanna get something done, it's you versus you. So you say you wanna get it done, it's huge. So cause once you get it done, it's like damn. Like I already said I was gonna do it, and I did it no matter what, and um, making sacrifices, you know? I sacrificed my time. Facts. I sacrificed, um, you know, not being able to talk to people and just not, and my, my privacy, just for this. Hey buddy, hold your chat. Before we reset, bro, I wanna go ahead and tell y'all, bro, y'all niggas is goats, for sure, okay? Y'all niggas is goats, and we did this shit, we really put our mind to it, and we did it, you feel me? This shit is crazy. Ah, oh, fuck. <sighs> the first thing I said was, I'm not gonna lie. If you do a subathon, do it different. Do it different. Do it different. He's like, rage, my boy. I'm having a 24 hour sip. He told me the whole, I'm, I'm gonna have cameras on me at all time. And immediately I knew he was gonna change the game. Immediately, I knew he was gonna change the game. I didn't, in my head, I, I wasn't thinking sub record, cause it just wasn't in my, but I knew it was gonna be some big, crazy shit. And it blew my expectations, I ain't gonna lie. I know he's gonna break this sub record. I'm saying that right now, he hasn't broken it yet, but he's gonna break it. He got four days left of this shit, three, four days left, and he gonna break it. He got like 250, 255 right now, he gonna break it. I didn't think that was gonna happen. Uh, if you asked me this a year ago, cause I wasn't really thinking about that, cause that's crazy. But uh, yeah, I knew this Susie told me gonna do a was gonna yeah. be one of the best subathons of all time, and it is. It's, it's, it's number one subathon, bro. No, no glazing. Am I glazing? I'm not glazing. That's just facts. No, it's number glazing. one subathon. It's number one subathon Definitely of all time. Number. I don't care. I don't care. I he, ain't gonna be, he ain't gonna be able to, to wake this up in mornings, tired, go in my closet, and just think like, dang, is this ever gonna be over? Or like, dang, is this something I really want to do? Or can I even complete it? But after I, I came to a realization that that's the main point of it. That's one of the major, major points of it, and which is like, bro, it's gonna be trials and tribulations where it's gonna test you to stop right here, and what's gonna separate you from everybody else that you didn't. is will you keep going or will you just stop? Incivic! Was that Incivic? Chat, 300. Coco Chats with the 50 gifted. Bro, chat! Chat! 28 days, chat. 28 days, no privacy, cameras on at all time. This has been the hardest thing of my life and I'm glad I did it. I challenged myself. I said I was going to do something. We said we was going to do something and we did it. We did it. We did it, bro. We did it. We said we going to do it. This is hard work. Chat, I got to bro, chat. I'm tired, bro. I'm going to keep saying it over and over. I'm tired, bro. I don't care. I don't care. Never get tired, bro. Never get tired, chat. Never, ever. Whatever you want to do, you can do it. Y'all seen it happen here first. Word to my mother, you seen it happen here. Day first. Whatever you want to do. I don't give a fuck. I'm sorry. Thanks to everybody who's gifted right now. Shout out to everybody. Oh, look, show them, show them right here. Oh, bro, oh, we did it. 
Out of everybody, we did it, bro. Us. Dang, bro. Last run, last run. Woo. Here we go. There we go. Oh, there was time, bro. Chat. We did very toxic. And I, w I wouldn't say I was, I was worried, but there was times where I wasn't on pace to beat it. Um, there was times where the chat would be telling me to, hey, change the time to this, change the time to that, add more time. Um, there were times where the chat, where I asked the chat, yo, y'all think we gonna hit the record? And everybody would say no. There was times where I went into other streamers' chats, and they would ask, yo, is Kyle on pace to beat the record? And you know, chat would say no. Um, and you know, that, of course, that like had me thinking mentally, yo, what if I did all this and I didn't even break it? I knew that it was gonna be possible. I knew that they could do it. Um, and they executed. Chat 300! Chat 300! Chat 300! Oh my god! Chat! Chat! Chat 300 fucking thousand, bro! Dang, that's oh my god! Oh my god, bro! Oh, that shit is small. 300,000. Oh my god. I'm gonna tell her, let me tee up, let me tee up. Chat, let me tee up. I can't. I can't. I can't. We can't do that, bro. I don't even can't have a favorite that. part of the summertime. I think my favorite part of the summertime was like just the experience, bro. Just seeing all the all the ups and downs of it. All like the, the momentum of it. All like seeing the chat like going to its lowest and then coming back up to its Dang. highest um and actually being able to say my favorite time of the summer time probably be actually say that i completed it and i was able to do it and you know just making just making history in black during black history month was crazy to me so um yeah damn get up the five minus the five how do you feel less than 30 minutes accomplished bro accomplished is what i feel like happy Sad, all emotions. Chat, how y'all feel right now? How y'all feel, chat? Jazzy with the five. Martia with the five. It's those with the five. Minutes with the ten. Jay Longo with the five. GG with the five. Any man with the five. Jojo with the five. Easy with the five, a voto with the five. Yeah, bro, I'm just looking at everybody type right now, chat. All four. You better have 20 more minutes, chat. You better have 20 minutes. Minutes with the five. <laughs> bro, 20 minutes, I'm not gonna see y'all for a little bit. Jayco with the five, Z Boys with the five. We at the end, we at the finish line. We are at the finish line. I love y'all niggas so, so much. I appreciate y'all. 300,000. Put your mind on something, you can do it, bro. Y'all be healthy, y'all be safe. Y'all take care of yourselves, bro. Chat, I fucking love y'all. And I will see y'all when I come back. Oh my gosh, bro. Oh my gosh. The longest 30 days of my life. Crazy, bro. It's over. This shit dead over, bro. I'm gonna go to sleep. It's always happening. I get mad energy at the end. <laughs> I get mad energy at the end. Damn, bro. Where's chat at? Where's chat? Where's chat? Yeah. Come on, where's, where's the mouse? You gotta Clear put it, it once. It. Oh. And. Oh my. There's Shadow there. Damn, bro. Nigga, this is what that chunk is. Shit! I can call people. You I can call people. I can go outside. I can jack off. I can be as butt ass nigga to take I a shot. I should not be in the fuck with you. I can do whatever. Yeah, I started in the oh. back, had to skip the line, no, oh, I'ma keep that shit a stack. Big one, dummy, every nigga. time. And he's never gonna explain to nobody, and I feel like you shouldn't have to never explain, explain to nobody. He's gonna reach higher than what he's gonna do. Slide, pull the bruise.
Man, man I'm so proud of you, bro. You deserve it all. You really do, man. Like a gen. To nobody, and I feel like you shouldn't have to never explain to nobody. He's gonna reach higher than what he is now. And I'm just so proud of him. I'm so proud of my team. I do love you and everything you did. You know, at Stan World, we all appreciate it. And we want to see you do way better. Because we know this is not the end. We always know this is not the end. And it's always, always gonna be more. And just know we all here for that more. I'm proud of you. Like, for real, I'm proud of you. All jokes aside, all the sibling jokes, I'm proud of you. And you really came from, like, you really came from the bottom. And you really worked, 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 and got it to the top, and I'm proud of you for that. That's like, that's, that's different. That's different. Like, you didn't, he didn't mean nothing different. That's crazy. That's you, were, you inspirational. You know what I'm saying? You inspire me. I'm proud of you. But just for, you know what I'm saying, for the record, you're a liar. You know you be having the big t-shirt on with, the, with no draw. Just stop spreading that lie. My one message to you is like, hopefully you don't hate streaming. After the subathon, we've seen too many of our favorite streamers do a subathon and then become part-time. So hopefully, you feel me, you still enjoy doing it and shit. That's real tough. I feel like the internet will be, that'd be tough for all of us if you just like pull the bruise. Man, I'm so proud of you, bro. You deserve it all. You really do, man. Like, genuinely, like, it makes me so happy to see you at the top, bro. Like, you really deserve it. No one's done what you just did. Like, real shit, no one has even came close to what the fuck you just did. You gonna say it's glazing, but I'm gonna say I'm really happy for my man. It's like, real shit, like, he deserves it all. Like, that's what I have to say to him. I will be the last loyal man standing. I will always have his back. When the world is against him, I will be at his feet supporting him. Yeah. <laughs> First off, I'll give my thanks to God himself. I think my son, my, I'll give my thanks to God due to the fact that without him, I wouldn't be able to do any of this. Um, thanks to my team, production, everybody behind the scenes that helped me do this whole thing and sacrifice 30 days of their life to see something come true. Um, anybody who stopped by, AMP, um, Rage, uh, my family, anybody who helped. And the biggest thanks, um, one of the biggest things I had to do is thanks to the people who watched, who tuned in, who actually paid money to, you know, sub up. And, and I hope you guys were very entertained with all everything. And, uh, you know, I just want to say thank you to everybody who in some way, shape, or form, whether it was a follow, whether it was just stopping by the stream, whether it was just, you know, just supporting the movement, I would just say thank you. Um, because I would, it's something I would never personally forget, ever. And we did it. <laughs> we made history. So, um, yeah. Hey, it's me, your skin. I, I crave being clear without irritation. Sarah. That was lit. Very inspirational, man. Shout out Kai Sinat. Like, for real, I know this has been a long video for sure, so I'm not even finna hold y'all long, man. But shout out to everybody that stayed to the end. Everybody that watched it with me, man, I really appreciate it, bro. That's the kind of vibes that we are on, man. This is what we're trying to do. We're trying to build a community. Dude showed a lot, man. He showed a lot, bro. He showed that it can be done. That's one thing. He showed that it can be done, like, for real. So, shout out to everybody, man. Stay with the nerds like Urkel Jalil, man. Man. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. Appreciate it, man. We on our way up. And I'm out, bro.